Aleluya. Aleluya. We glorify the holy name. Kawe lama, kawe. We glorify your holy name. Kawe lama, kawe. Hallelujah. Jesus. Heavenly Father, we pray. We invite you in this place. Eka mendiga Jesu Christ was in Nazareth. As we about to start, kulungulu tui nwele kala nati. Kulungulu weto na mandla. Konge sikwenza yoglinda wa kubogotu mulu wako. Kulungulu weto nwele. In the mighty name of Jesus.
Ezekiel Paramisi Kamala Kwebsu Eka Meni Liga Jesu Baba Siel Paramisi Kamala Kwebsu Gulu Gulu Etona Manka We lift you high, oh God High above every other God Gulu Gulu Etona We worship you, oh God Father, we worship you, Gulu Gulu Etona you said in your word, you seek those who shall worship you in spirit and in truth. Because God, you are spirit. We worship you. There is none like you, O God. There is none like you, Gulu Gulu, a twin way. Baba, we're torn a mantra on it. Siak Dumi, Sangulu Gulu, a top again. We lift you high, oh God. We give you glory. We give you honor, Gulu Gulu, a twin way. Gulu Gulu, a torn a mantra, Simona, Gulu Gulu, a funny swan away. No, my linga, this swan Utu David e mongu mpefu Mongu Jehovah mpefu Forget not his benefit Kulu kulu wetu ingwe luta singe ne masangwe na kongo kulela Singe ne matege na konge ndumiso Baba wetu na manda gege si kosho kutio senzele gona Kulu kulu wetu na manda siya bonga kulu kulu wetu ingwele Sia bongo kwa languwe. Sia bongo kulu kulu wetu na man. Dugu ba na kulu kulu onchenga wano kusa no time. Father, we love you, Lord. We love you, Jesus. We love you, kulu kulu wetu inwele. We love you, Holy Spirit. We honor you, kulu kulu wetu na man. We honor you, Heavenly Father. We honor you, Gulu Gulu Etwenyoele. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. Amen. Amen. Skatin Samanji and Tela Ugo Guangulusis, Amate, Provo Sisuetu, Ezosi Tetulela, a purpose of the day. Amen. Hallelujah, Bazalan. Hallelujah, Bazalan. Um, Sabonga could worship us. Um, Gabingelela, Ekamen and Gosses to Jesu Christ as a Nazareta, Siabonga Kulu, MC way to Siamoba, Java de Sishilo Bazalani, E. Kamalam Guamate, Wagandovu, Namijin, Mutana Kulukulo in the Lumo Sabazalan, Amen, Gabingala Kuluma, Navazalan in Havana, Vosia Bunguti, Ni Onarisha, E. Invite Hate Massin Kailutin is a Kulumanati. On this different service, service here in Amtlat Bazalane is very different from the usual ones that we over now. Um, but we don't limit the Holy Spirit Bazalane. So whenever the Holy Spirit wants to do Umsebenzi Wake, we will always let Him do Umsebenzi Wake. Amen. Um, Shabbat Bazalane. Before I go to the purpose of this service here in Amtlat, the Kuluman Amtlat is who deputy president of MSCF because I am the one. Oh, hosted this service together with Upra and Healing and Evangelism and Missions Office of uh, Maybe before I go to the purpose of this service and I'm planned, I'd like to call on part with U Chepesin, U Spusis on my Spusis on Chalik and also part with Spusis 
welcome Charlie to just remind us of who MSCF, what MSCF is, who we are, what we stand for, uh, before I go to the purpose of today. Just mam Hallelujah. Amen. Gyan bingele la bazalwane. Ekamen na sikazin liya Jesu Christu kwa sinazareta. Amen. Ngbingele liga kulu nje kuma abafundi sinje bonga hamba nabo. Siswe itungapa. Ngya bingele la nje bazalwane. Ngya itoba ka kulu mkuti babe kona pagati kwetu. Gwi nte nkulu ka kulu. Siambonga futu kukulu nkulu kuti Bagwazi luti babi nati Mbingelele nje Abazalwane bonke Again sibonga nje kuti Abaningi sebabu ile Epasigen We know kuti abanyi Basinga gabuhi hallelujah Bazo buya over the weekend Kote nje siambonga kukulu nkulu nkulu Ukuti si siambile Abanyi baba kona laite wini And we celebrated The great work of the cross Bazalwane Ngoba nkulu lento kate Sipu ngaza over the weekend Uti Msebe nziwa se kalvari onga aga That's why si lana That's why si wazu uti Sibe ne privilege Ugui biza Nkabantu wana baka nkulu nkulu Gunge nga ya loko bazalwane So kubalegi ili nje Uti sik celebrate So nje Ikamalami nje ngobe se shilo Nkusbu siso Isbongo waka mchali Nge mtanda kulu nkulu nkulu Nkusindisiwe Nge uchepe sinwe MSF Gule temle Amen Amen Amen. So, um, eh, nji, agukni ingba zalwane, eh, nisikolele, sibe na ma technical issues nji akona, eh, siya vamsilegu project ala, koto wage na msa nji, ay project, ila ay project, akma TV anga pantle, anga zwenze njan, koto nji, mklambe guzo lunga, makambi skati, haleluwe, eh, bebe siti nji mklambe, eh, constitution based on a project and I will so a um party a big busy lady would see and you show a brief reminder of the MSCF a go back a Cuba leggy levels alone a a match it is a a deputy president a would see a Cuba we are now open a would see this is a single lane in a constitution and so in the ballet like now go on good to me let's understand more about msf so msf medical students christian fellowship basal one nj we always say good we are a non-denominational organization so it doesn't matter which christian background of kanga giona you are always welcome with msf hallelujah so um we uh, MSF, we you do bazalwane uh, find everything we constitution uh, from ikama everything ikona we constitution so nothing je mshambe opening is a yona so a constitution bazalwane is a is a is a is a body of fundamental principles uh, according to which an organization is run hallelujah uh, so nothing je see MSF and even for us to be recognized in medical school. We look good. We must have an organization. The university must know how is this organization run. So nothing just now. And then it lays the fundamental framework, Bazalwan, of its structure. Say to good. Siganja ni gukona oba ni in leadership. Ati na ma roll up. So. Gubalegi lenjuguti songe si si singa ma members of the MSF si ya zifuti si be family ngayo hallelujah so nje mshambe into kala nje nzo kuluma ngayo eko na uguti as the MSF was set to portray this is our preamble basalwan. A preamble is a preparatory statement.
or an introduction so it sets out a stage nje maukhuluma nge preamble everyone must know what okay immediately mele e click ngqondweni kumuntu ukuthi kena bayini kahle kahle so as the MSCF we are set to portray the love of Christ to every individual uh, in medical school fraternity we welcome everyone who comes to our platform of fellowship with the intention of learning and confirming to our belief and in the faith of lordship of our lord uh, jesus christ and the sovereignty of the word of god which is the holy bible this includes christian from every denomination and all believers so and then we we also have our vision as the msf and the mission so this is our vision uh, hallelujah uh, so uh, as the medical students christian fellowship we we said to be the salt of the earth that will never lose its taste strength and quality and to be the light of the world that will never be hidden this is our vision and then basically siba ne 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 mission bazalwane eh mission nike by definition uh, is a duty noma eh, is an assignment ukuthi ukuthi sikhona la medical school eh mangabe singakwenzi lokho bazalwane eh cishe kufanele nokuthi siyadlala ngoba this is our duty so eh njengobubona again imission yethu is taken from a, a bible verse eh, as christian medical students we commit ourselves to seek the transformation of our medical school by bringing to every heart and mind the good news of the kingdom of god and for this transformation to at work in every dimension of our institution institution and to make disciples in all nations this is from matthew uh, chapter 28 uh, verse uh, verse 19 uh, yes uh, and then je sing is uh, i will just uh, read ama aim is now we msf according to the constitution so we aim to mobilize christian in a vision for the health profession to develop people's individuality within the community of believers to capacitate uh, capacitate the students in word and deed to be Christ like to their patients to present uh, God's truth to the challenges facing the health profession to promote programs and projects that foster interest for uh, service in neglected areas evangelism throughout the university uh, to participate in the mentorship programs within the health profession uh, to promote alumni relation with pro uh, which will propagate the aims of the organization so these are some some of our aims bazalwane and a a a brought in the part a a i'm sure would see a siabona song a good again a amanya ma program akhona kule aim lawa siyawenza nje especially o community outreach sinokwenza nje ngoba ibhaliwe lapha yana race fellowships akhona nje as part of our aims so nje bekuyilokho and ukunikhumbuza nje bazalwane ukuthi i constitution ayizange yabhalwa nje umuntu wabese wayibeka i constitution kusuke kukuthi every member of the of the, of the msf uh, agreed on that constitution so this means that a uh, guba uh, in a uh, annual general meeting in october where everyone has to adopt the constitution or if a uh, gukona umuntu of unwenza amendments additions or subtractions a gumele arrays a little point and the whole organization must agree to that or special general meeting of which is uh, the executive committee and they have to send a uh, agenda at least 14 days prior a uh, uh, show with why sifuna uh, ugwenza e amendment we constitution so nje begui logo bazalwane and i hope with a so in cases of a family and we will uh, again send it a uh, quick group chat here to a uh, good song case see as hallelujah and get on and part hallelujah 
Amen. Sabonga kulum party. Um, Bazalone, I think um, the Indians would in Kalum party just to go through our constitution, would in Java decision, would he um seven the way office and gig loan is to ensure would he as the MSCF we adhere to the constitution, Bazalone. Um, so Isabisa and Amshanje is part of that, would he we are adhering to that mission of making disciples in all nations. Um, I'm sure we are all aware of the fivefold ministries, um, the apostles, the prophets, the evangelists, the pastors, and also the teachers of the gospel of God. I mean, I like to believe, Wuti, there is power in young people. I mean, I like to believe, Wuti, I know, Wuti, Usatane, if he can, he wants to destroy the church, he will target Abantabash. So if we do not install Lento a fivefold ministry within us as Abanda Basha, if we do not get Abandu who will equip us, Uguti, once we take the ministry that Unkulunkulu has called us into, at least we have been taught by people as a been experience, at least we have been um Sinigama lessons, Uguti, how do we go about because e e e character no ma profile that you get without being led by the Holy Spirit. So now if we're getting Abantu who who, who will teach us once you, you take a, a, a step into in entering the ministry that you have been called to, this is how you walk, this is how you do, this is how you make sure that you are always uh, intimate with the Holy Spirit. So the purpose of the day Bazalwane it is to teach train and equip ministers on how to present the gospel of Christ Jesus in a space where you have been afforded to. Because Bazalani, there are opportunities where you need to talk about Jesus Christ. There are times, there are spaces where you need to speak about your Jesus Christ to save someone who is next to you, to save a sister or a brother who is dying next to you, who just needs you to speak about Jesus Christ. So today, Bazalani, we have one of our BOO members who will just speak to us on how do we present this gospel of Jesus Christ to other people. Because we are still young, but we need to be trained. How do we present the gospel of Jesus Christ to people without, besides, in a respectful manner, in a loving manner, in a humble manner? Amen. Um, so, I'm to research about ministry and I'm going to corner the three C's of ministry. There is a Christ like character, there is a Christ like conviction and there is a ministry competency. And then when I looked at the conviction, what I, 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 I tried to understand was what is a Christ-like conviction? And it said, conviction is when the Holy Spirit reveals an area of sin of which um, you need to confess and to repent to. So Bazalani, imagine if each and every time we are in constant um, communication with the Holy Spirit and immediately you do something that displeases the Lord, the, the Holy Spirit convicts you. And in that instant in time, you take a moment and to say, let me repent and give you son and uncle uncle. Amen, Bazalani. So um, without wasting time, I think it's already half past. Um, so, so as the MSCF Bazalane, um, as Nababa Befundis, as um, as we are a non denominational organization, which means we are not a church. We are allowing people from different churches who believe in Christ to come and fellowship with us. But we have parents, Bazalan, because we need guidance. So we have three board of overseers. We have Ubab Jamugo Bab Habile and Speaker Setu Sanam Sanj Bazalan. So our speaker for today is um, Udo Tapi Masinga. So I'll just go through the profile yake Bazalani and the experience yake. And then before Ngimbiza, Gizotela, Onarisha, Iwe Shipale, to there is within us. Uma Mumbata. So uh, before Uma Massinga, Ezo Kuluma, so tell and Uma Mumbata, I shy and go with shipping my hand. Amen. So I said, I'm I will go through a profile, Gamma Bazalani. So we have U Doctor Masinga, who is a remarkable woman who wears many heads. She is a successful medical doctor with a, with a driving GP practice in Umhlanga 
a devoted wife to Pastor Abe Masinga, the senior pastor and founder of Deben Worship Center, and a loving mother to three children, Kenzani, Lira, and Zago. Dr. Masinga is an ordained pastor and founder of Doctors with Compassion, leading a team of medical professions who volunteer their time and expertise to provide medical services to undeserved communities in South Africa. The organization conducts medical missions in rural areas where access to medical care is limited or non-existent. Doctors with Compassion provide much-needed medical care, including general checkups, dental services, and health education. As a woman um, leader in society, Dr. Masinga is also a founder of Porsche Ladies Foundation, yes, <laughs> which provides uh, leadership coaching and mentorship to women and girls uh, by providing skills, training, empowerment, discussions, and business mentorship. The foundation also supports uh, various community projects that benefit women and children. So uh, in terms of her experience, so Dr. Masinga has over 17 years of experience practicing in the medical field. She has held uh, various leadership roles in the Guazulu Natal Department of Health before entering private practice. Um, these include having served in the following positions. So she has been a medical officer in anesthetics at Inkosi Albert Lutuli Central Hospital and the principal medical officer uh, for KZN Forensics Pathology se se Services. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. Glory to Jesus. A command on failure to Jesus Christ was a Nazareta. Conabang as the Leguzo, Uzo, Colabang, you pillars, a little mammy, a Lubongi, Camalenco, Sibazalan. Giswa Amasui Cachesu. Eti unge sabi ushilo watange kangi shi. Gomsali tuma isulu unya silusa beka amats. Oluanse ma ku kulu e fishata fisugungi kui inya o ka.
May we decrease, O oh God, that you may ever increase in this place. Have your way in the name of Jesus and everybody say amen. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. I greet you, beloved, in the wonderful and the most precious name of my Lord and Savior. Amen. To all the student leadership that might be in this place, it is such a privilege, it is such an honor to be gathered in this place. Amen. Si
shalom, un shalom, un shalom. there were moments where I could feel what is saying chat you we are chat why love when you cannot stand on your own and there's a shoulder that carries you I bong because Nam Sanjing Twanagan Kulunkul in Tebaleghi Lenje, um Tanda Yunkulunkul. I don't stand before you because I qualify any better, but I know a loving hand of God that was able to reach out and save me. That is why today Gunalop Fagas would impel Unjalo, of course, impel Unjalo. Amen. And we will keep it interactive. Allow me to welcome the servants of the Lord that are in our midst. Ente mankuluma nabo bangkyo ni paka kulu. Engi ya toba kakulu ukusebe nsana ne ingegu eziti maibizwa zisabele. Even in the midst of our programs abo abizi kakulu. As I speak. But before us, as I introduce them, Dr. Mapope Nkabangutini Yamazi is an alumni and was also a member of the executive of the MSCF back in the days. I will not expose his age because I'm saying totally consent. So I will not tell you, can we welcome him? <laughs> Next is a servant of God. I call him the apostle of our time, the Paul of our time. Oh, Mr. Shandu Umzwandile Esmazio Kakulu Jengomtia. Aibong Gwinkosi. Bese kubakona umfundisi Esmaz Kakulu around the social media space. A man of God, pastor, Shezi that is well known. Ika malake with social media anga gala zigathe. O Akim anga zuguti li kamga. Normally we ID, but he it isn't the ID. Oh, I thought you created it. But he is one that speaks the truth and the raw truth as it is. Umagu konu Rory sang. I call him our Rory sang. Ndola sam shaile zanda esse zanga pambi. Chairperson, for making it so easy for me. Because Bengzo Elang or Kulugui Toba Oguta Mekia to Sua Posengale, we bena, because as I was praying, into Ayenza, Kuba Leg and Amsange to keep it interactive. Ageku Maozo by his Vute Vute and Amsange says, O Kuluma Makiniso, I bong and goes, Chekuma Kelwa, no good you are in the right place. Sometimes go balegi luguti si fundi sane si palama noti si fundi sane 
ukuze siphume sabantu abakhekile ngakho konke futhi beqilisiwe ezwini ayibongwe inkosi uma umphathi e introducer with a vision ye MSCF ngiyayibuka lento babushandi ukuthi medical students by virtue ukuthi uregistile you, you, you qualify bese kuba khona le pathetic christian ukhona yini phakathi kwethu ongakabambi ongakamthulu jesu njengenkosi nomsindisi ngoba kuyasiza ukuthi sihlale sihlale sibuzane sitshe ukuthi sahamba nawe kulayino wodwa noma mhlambe ekhona la usadinga ukhanyiseleka khona kubalekile ngoba uzozithola mhlambe u criticize izinto kanti ngoba lo christian awukabambi sila ngenxa yokuthi silandele ukristo futhi ukristo uphila kithi into esenza sihlangane iyona leyo into ezokwenza ukuthi ungakhubeki ubahambe lo christian ukuze ube christ like cuz sonke we are pursuing that christ like nature that christ like character si sisendleleni nje si sizama ngayo yonke indlela ukuthi ubuthina buye ngokuncibilika buphele ukuze uKristo avele kithi whether use classin whether use res whether use spedlela whether use basini whether use khaya akuvela ubuKristo kuwe yona lento esihlanganisayo bese challenge number 4 fellowship Now for us to have fellowship we need to understand what does fellowship entail because it is not enough ukuthi masengisindisiwe kube yimi ohamba nepene libovu ake nkhulumeni nawe nje keyboard play kube yimi ohlale qala iketa emfishane nezinde abangakhulumi kahle aba kube yimi nje no matter ukuthi uba no invite ile kodwa yime ngihleli nepene libovu ngiyathiko wrong ngiyathi bathi bayangena ngapha mina ngibakhipha ngapha ayibongwe inkosi siyadinga ukuunderstand ukuthi for us to have fellowship we need to be able to go out there and invite people but more than anything our behavior must invite them even before tina sibamema ngamazwi et fanele kube khona othi ngizele la ngoba ngibone urumza indlela behave ngayo khona kufanele afikela athi be ngithi ngisisonke res kodwa ngiyabona indlela ekwenzeka ngayo ukuthi no le nhlobo yabantu abeza la bahamba ngale indlela benza kanye indlela eniphasa ngayo fanele ifakazele ukuthi you are christ like and you are excellent in all you do fanele kube nokufakaza ukuthi ngithengise ngisenza i clacking my patient kwakhona uthi hayi mani ngihlale ngibabona ama medical student ezothathi history khona lo mntwana ofikile atshela banye belele kweminye imbedi khona lo mntwana odlulela indlela khuluma ngayo there is something about them afakazela abanye ngenxa yokwenza kwethu nithemanisho ukuthi vision yethu suwusawothi there are certain things that are so important and crucial about usawothi usawothi awudinga ukufaka uningi isikhathi esiningi mawubheka ama recipe noma 200 just a pinch of salt it is not about big numbers but it's about the concentration of usawothi it is about usawothi pre- preserving in nature yawo njengosawothi ungathi ngoba ususe thekwini bese uthi konke kuvumelekile wenza into ephambana ngisho neemfundiso zasekhaya iba usawothi khona ethekwini ungashintsha inature yakho ngoba kuvumelekile nezinye izinto zivu iba usawothi into ebaleke ngosawothi noma ungaba ke phi make wafaka usawothi changes the te- the the taste of the whole dish or late akwazi ukufaka usawothi kube duma in fact awukwazi ukufaka usawothi kubola ukudla kuna ma characteristics athize abalekile ngosawothi ngifuna wonke umuntu namhlanje azibheke ungabi sathi hayi khulunywa no rumza namhlanje cha sonke sikhuluma ngathi 
if Peggy light, Gishos not in my little room in Kuluga Naga, Gifage e candle, Nele load shedding. The moment there is light, there will be light in the room. No matter how insignificant, no matter how small, no matter how cheap the candle is, the fact that it is present. There is light. The fact that you are in this medical school, not any other, there is something so significant by you being in that seat. There are so many people that probably had even better marks. But it is you, by the grace of God, you are in that seat. Always wake up in the morning and say, Lord, you've made me to be in this place. What is your purpose and your will about my life in this place? You are a remnant. You are the salt. Do not conform to the standards. There is something that God is doing through you. Allow him. Uyazi upol gifunung laleli nkulumoyamu. Agesi pege u Colossians chapter 2. Of verse 6, but I will read it shortly. And now, just as you accepted Christ Jesus as your Lord, you must continue to follow him. Let your roots grow deep into him and let your lives be built on him. Then your faith will grow in the truth you are taught. And you will overflow with thankfulness. That's all this. Six and seven. Six and seven. Nga koge, jenga loko, ni mamugele ukrestu chesu, inkosi, hambani ni guye, ni tlilile, na kiwe guye, ni kinisiwe egu kolweni, Jenga loko nifundi siwe, nivame ugubonga. This is a clear instruction that Paul is writing to this church. It is a church that was in Colosse where he had never been himself. He writes he's in jail in Rome. But kwa koni ngegwe ya ipendu kile, eshumayele ya EFS, upaipirasa, nglazi kulisho katika. My figure, Genga Yogutu Bambu Sawot. My figure, go to Gaya Kaya, Guapenduga e Colosse, Guaba Nebandla, because of a young person that was in Ephesus. Namanya Mazui, Kunum to a no la etewino ze medical school. Cotang Naye MSCF. Abambu psawoti, ati mayebu yela nishe kaya, kushinche i flavor ne taste yendawo. Abanta bambo nangu pol e kolose, waise chele mayepal. But then I go to Guasa Figio, O Petu Sawoti, Guashincha, Guaba ne revolution in the area. And when you read more about this particular area, I discovered Uguti Guagu inda with an anetegu, ea in a harbor a busy. Therefore, Guagna Bantu Baconala. There were Greeks that were there from the time of Alexander the Great. There were, there were Romans that were there because at that time it was a Roman colony. And there were Jews at that time. Meaning, John Bagne mixture yama poly, abantu nama religion, ayesanga sangen. Lento yenzu kuti makufiku mfana zo shumayela kwa pendu kwa bantu kwa kala kwa bane Christianity. Kwa hamba kwa hamba kwa figi skati laba nyesebeti kwa tamngane yena lumfana. Lezi ndai kuluma ya shuti ziizo. Ba questiona izwi ayel shumayela that was the pure gospel and the love of Christ. Bagala bati kwa tapelatina, sikule sazu huti, mautati lamveltize, bagala batlanganisi zinto, nobu krestu. 
So my balala, we are correct and over was a corner easing to us in Genile. Uba Zalwa Naba Cindy see Wabam Tanda in Kulunkul. Got a babafun in day bambegata. A gupuze na commands. Best we are tanders a best opindu shanganis, opindu shumis. We near Israel Leon. Nanam Sanji Sakona Leon. Got we are yala. Uti Hambani Niku ye. Gatla Lagu Crest. In a cotimin and gum vino wona wona. As telly tell us not say, look we. Tinas funukbonu crest as funukbona e e background yako e fancy e uti kanje kanje nene understand abanta ba. Uma uyak bantu ba funu crest ba funu kulunkur. Unga figi ne title yako. Unga figi ne bank account yako. Unga figi ne prestigious. Presentation and status. Vezu Christ. The gospel is free and it's simple. Amen. Hambani ni ku Christ. Ni kili siwe. Kuye. Impanda zibe kuye. Ngoba uzoba umzalwa no nga kuli umi impanda zinge kukuye. You see, in the fun and a stroke, Nina Ningabona a particular body part iba wasted and spastic. Canting over there is poor communication between the brain and that area. Uma um Zalwanong a Shediku Crest Kunezin to as Besa when uti hai, he he, kantu we no se file, enda wene ngabu kili swe ku. Ay pong wengos. As ngabi abaza luana bakulayo, kotu tulti sandla, as kon wenza, im sebenze mile. Aunga ti mausu sindi siwe, um tandung kulung ulu. Koto nga bonaka lutando lwake. Lubona unkulu nkulu wezenzo. Ngiti sishonjalo masimbongele. Nabaga Israel. Babeti mabeti bayatanda. Zabati sikboni luhamba nati. Sikboni lethane. Sikboni luvulu luandre. Nati manje sifunu kbonu tando. Lika krestu. Through you. When you invite people. Let them feel the love of Christ. More than the arguments, nama ideology. Don't invite them to your pastor. Invite them to Christ. Don't invite them to the fancy place. Invite them to Christ. I bong in course. Nam tanja si zoti ba usawot. Umbuzo ubuziwe ba fundis bam bengenzelung talela. Angina ntloso yokshumayela. Utumbuzo. How do we approach people? How do we correctly handle those that are being saved? As MSCF, we are not a church. So how do we deal with different denominations? And help us have a clear understanding of salvation. Giza milu ngalela gota genant imbuzo. Gizo ela ngokuluguz tob. Uglulisa gini. Ni bege logunkulungulak bega you. You can handle any one of those questions. You don't have to follow the order. Bese ginike itu. Giafisa bazalone gube interactive. Amen. So as they are speaking, make notes. Let us engage. Uguze si pumela better people. Aibongu nkos. By their nature and their calling, Bahamba ama ama offices are shugile. Kono umvangel, kono postol, kono mshumail, kono of or tisha ways. So they will approach these differently. Let us allow the grace. Unkulunkulas busi senga bonam change. God bless you. Uh, amen. Bazalwan. Um. 
I'm, I'm, oh, my name is Usel Bima Pope. Uh, as uh, uh, Mama Singh has already said, I am an alumni of this university. When I came in, I was surprised <laughs> because ju just, just to give you an idea, I, I, I'm seeing this for the first time. <laughs> like, seriously, in, in, in my day, this was not there. And in my day, MSCF had just started. So anyway, let's leave it at that. Uh, I, 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 I want to start here. Um, I'm, I'm going to start from where, where, where Mama Singa um, started, like where she ended. Um, I'll use this stroke again as an example. Um, and I'll answer one of the issues that Umpati mentioned about the ministry gifts. Um, there is an area in the brain called the homunculus. We all know about that, right? Um, <laughs> <laughs> right, so, 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 so what the homunculus is, for those of us who do not know, it's the representation of the body in the brain. So to explain that, um, going from, from, from the aspect of the ministry gifts, I believe, I don't care what whoever else believes, I believe that in the house of God, there is no one who is superior to anyone. All of us are the same. The, the, the reason why we have hierarchy in the church is just so that there will be order. So we are not disorderly in our nature. So there is not one person who has all the answers in the house of God. So when God gives us the ministry gift, he gives us as he himself is the head of the church. Remember what I said about the homunculus. The head is where the homunculus is found. So the, the, the control of the whole body comes from the head. And the head is Jesus Christ himself. So if, if, if we are not connected to the head, if there is no nerve conduction that takes the message from the head to the body part that we are, there won't be any activity. So meaning, um, taking it further, the Bible says to some he gave to be apostles, to some he gave to be teachers, to some. It doesn't say he gave everything to one person. He is the only person who has everything in himself. All of us, as you see us, there the, the, the are different giftings that we are given by him as the head. Um, ooh, ooh, some time back, I was talking to Ubab Habil, and we were talking about these things, Yamason, why, why are there different churches? And then he made me realize that, you see, if I am the food, for an example, as a teacher, if you come to my church, my church will be more concentrated on teachings. Why? Because the leader of the church is operating in that particular gift, in that particular ministry. If you go to a church that's prophetic, where the leader is a prophet, we'll, we'll be prophesying the whole service. If it's, it's, it's evangelism, we'll be casting out demons every day. You know why? Because the person who is a leader in that particular church is more concentrated in the wolf, that one part. That's the gifting. So this is to say the only person who has it all in, in himself is, is the Lord Jesus Christ. Um, which is one of the reasons why U -U 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 Mama Singa decided in her wisdom that um, if we want to be comprehensive in the way we approach the questions that you guys have posed. Let it not come from one angle. Let it come from the different giftings that we have within the church. And the giftings that come from the head, which is Jesus Christ. Um, now, uh, I, 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 I will look at wha what you say to people as we are not a church. How do you then interact with the rest of the community? See, we were talking about it yesterday. Uh, Shandu was not there. Umenzi was there. And we were saying there are things which are true, which we say in a wrong way. Um, the gospel is not about making people aware of their sin. That's not the purpose of the gospel. The purpose of the gospel is to preach the love of God to people. So the love of God will convict people of their sin. The minute I come and say, you're a drunkard, 
what happens is you you block me you close you stop listening to me but if i come to you and say god loves you irrespective of whoever you are whatever your 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 behavior is like but god loves you and i preach the love of god to you what's going to happen is the love of god will convict you the minute i start trying to actively convict you of your sin and make you repent what i'm trying to say uh, is i have the power to change you and there is no one that has the power to change anyone only christ can change people and the way we introduce christ to people is by introducing his love to them that's that's the most important thing and 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 you see um some of us i mean i used to go to a white church and yeah and in 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 the white church that i used to go to um there's a guy who would come every day when we come to church uh you would find him outside smoking and then he switches over a cigarette then he comes into church and at the end of the service he goes he was never condemned because of his smoking he was never chased away from church because of his smoking in six months that guy has stopped smoking and the year end he was already uh, preaching in the church why because he was not condemned he was not made away of his sin we allowed god to change him and to make him into what god wants him to be so the one thing that actually disturbs us from reaching out to people is our condemning approach our judgmental approach instead of telling people about the love of god thank you hey ya bandi eko ni mbafit Hi. Hi. Yes, I'm going to learn it. Hey, I'm going to learn it. I'm going to learn it. I'm going to learn it. Now, um, I'm just going to be straightforward. We, we, we have a body of questions that we were asked. Uh, the first one is how do we approach people? As a Christian, our prime example is Jesus Christ. So how we approach people is looking at how he approached people. And he approached people with love and meekness. Now, uze kuba practical into a love. First Corinthians 13 verse 4 to 8 says that firstly love is patient, which means ukuthi umuntu mum approach for evangel uqala ngokuthi ube patient. Because when you are patient in your approach, it means that you are more observant of the person and then you have the skill to know how to approach them. Because if you are not patient ujaho ukuthi ujesu uyasha so far the rights were wrong then you're not going to have the skill to approach them because a person is a soul a soul has its own personality its own ideas its own way of thinking and seeing abafana bayeyazilento because abafana bakwaziyo ngempela ukushela baqala usisi bame observe oh okay unkunzana uthanda ama poem unkunzana uthanda ukezayi unkunzana uthanda iimbali So by the time that I approach you as a guy, I already know the things that you like. So my approach is going to be successful because I was patient enough to study you. Because when love is patient, it just means you see love studies, love observes, love takes it its time to see what umuntu ngizom approach kanja and go back successful kulent ya Christ. So in the sense I most of the time as a bazalwane, I used to do this because in high school Uh, I used to happen to be the president of E Christian Fellowship here corner. Tsena sazivutha ke singavuthiwe. Sivutha. By the time we were 18 sasithana zange elimi for 3 hours a day. I mean sivutha. Wonke umuntu nje you are gonna burn you going to hell. Wes sasi nezipho zikamoya. So ngivele ngikhuma umuntu wena uningculaza usofa. Khona la ngacishi ngashaba khona. So sometimes when you are in the spirit you you are able to see what okay lo muntu na linkinge kanje so ngavela ngaye ku muntu ngathi uNkulunkulu ange ngenxa futhi nengculaza so ngishaya ngempama now ngangicaba ngokuthi i spiritual warfare le nto yempama kanti god was showing me ukuthi my approach was not patient and kind so if you do not have the love of god Let's see when I go first Corinthians chapter number 13 verses 4 to 8. Iyona imira okwazi ukuyibuka khona ukuthi uthando lakho lo practical kangakanani. And lelo thando it's used even in our relationship as now kule fellowship le. Ngeke sithi siyathandana but we are not patient with each other. 
We are not kind with each other. Which goes to the second question. The second question is, how do you deal with somebody who's a newly born again? Melu understand who's Lomunt Ingan, Ingan. They are your brother, they are your sister, but they are a newborn. Now, there are three things as Lupama newborn. Number one, fire without wisdom. Lomunt Uzobanum Lilo, Ninchi Sagelo, for isn't the Sankulunkul. Kota Ana Uslani Pawezul. Because they are newborn. So when you are newborn, now we are as learned because you are like this. We are Vuta. Ufunuge Alana. Ufunuge Alana. Ufunuge Oreshop. Ufunuge Shumarela. Ufunuge Mamazel. A kind of watcher who sings in the sea of Mina. Gains is on tea. And tint and tint is gong and gafuta. But we are Vuta. Got our Vuti. So how you handle a newborn is understanding what's in Ganele. And the reason why Ibalegi Lelento, U first Peter chapter number two, verse one, Uti as newborn, crave the milk of the word. So how do you protect Sumunto Sanduksindis? You disciple them by teaching them the scriptures and the doctrine of salvation. Because Omuntu or newborn, Akfanel and Abu Ukichimagoma prophetic conference, Afundangama anointing Nama dimension, got in the Sagayas. And that is why I mean in our generation we had a problem. Because the first thing we knew. I knew about the 21 levels of prophetic revelation. Before I knew, what does it mean to be a Christian? Before I knew, I'm a fruit of the Holy Spirit. I manifest and my character. So how do you protect and deal with Umunto and Newborn? You teach them the milk of the word. And show what you have encouraged with as standards. We have encouraged with as fun to go to Jesus Christ. Why pillar and John? What is salvation? What does it mean to be discipled? What does it mean to disciple Abanyabantu? And lastly, the last question before we up hands, go with Kati, see the way. Ah, Leo love, are you kind? Are you kind, Leo love, Leo? Oh, question number five, Uti, how do you see if someone has grown spiritually? The same way Uboningan in the natural is the same way Uboningan in the spiritual. Umundo so kuli lengogo moya, they no longer mess themselves when they are eating. Which means, That's why people struggle with pornography and masturbation that you struggled with five years ago. It's still an issue now. Auko clean. So your growth spiritually is going to be seen by your ability to flee from sin. And no longer live in a cycle of easy into nama pleasures, nama last, jengengan. Because in Ghana is self control. But to Muntum Talun Nayo is self control. Uyakwazu Rizin, who goes, Mengilala Nalo Muntu Manj, but in Gitsukunkulunkulung Funuk Shat in the next three years. Then I am spoiling my character for the wife that I'm going to have. Because by the time I get married to Usindi, in Mondoyami, it's a Lutembega, Utembeli, Uzanele. Utandega. Yeah. Bazalone. Evangel. I'll change. Another thing is that they no longer need to be reminded of fellowship. In Ghana, Kogi, so. Ia chelugu to Gliwanin. Ia chelugu to Manjasagus Katsoglal. Umunto Kuli the spiritual. As I think of Chelugu, Sizagui fellowship. As I think of Kukuza, you must come on time. Must say seven or seven. Nothing past seven. You can't be grown spiritually, but you're always the one who's late in fellowship. That's not a sign of spiritual maturity. Spiritual growth, each and 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 each they no longer use crying to get something they want. In Ghana, missing as I own in Ghana, I sat at him because the phone into good morning. I was a cool man, Shanam, she's two. Gang, this was Nama Kurumgan, I was a cool. Gang, we are called Ulambil. Okay, we are called Usay Molisilo in Upkin, Aushongan, Agawas. Why? In Ghana. So as umuntu kuli le spiritually, usu ya guazu grizina, and usu ya guazu fellowship and abanya bazalwani without letting your emotions get the better of you. 
Ausaya no munto engage in gossip. Ausaya no munto tmina angenzi wanjalo min. Angpe nyo min. Ngengengengengengengengengengengengengengengengengengengengengengengengengengengengengengengengengengengengengengengengengengengengengengengengengengengengengengengengengengengengengengengengengengengengengengengengengengengengengengengengengengengengengengengengengengengengengengengengengeng
ngakhanyisele kaphi ke ukuthi labantu laba banamandla it was my last year at university i was a member of the src so there was a guy who was a, a comrade uh, he couldn't pitch up ukuzobhala i exam yakhe he was supposed to write a paper ngo 10 exam ngo 12 kufanele bese qedile yena wafika ngo 3 intamba amesikolini so this comrade comes to us ufika uthi kithi he couldn't go ukuyo bhala because unezinto ezimbambayo mekufanela vuke the glenti yambamba uba conscious uyabona yonke into but he cannot One, two. I think I'm in a minute. Eh, Lento, Lapo Funabacone, we are Voga Yam Lali, Salapo Funabacone, Laliam Vos. So there was a time Lapo Corner, Am Susa Corner, and I said Grayville, and I was consulting a second city, and I became city. No two exam. What worker this guy was offering us eating tin is Belgian. Air all one because it was a voice come cool work. We are busy all one. Not to explain. The other time, <coughs> wa banjo am a security. A second time in town. A phone was hanging. A bathroom. Now the bathroom. A phone was hanging. Go yo. Am a pipe. A corner. Mtape an ugly height. In the confusion, mas security. Go to. Oi, katla ganja in town. Bola papezul. It, it wasn't making sense. So, when we started the story to us, it was like it's scary, yeah, bo? because in a school, it's not cool. Man, as I see, understand. But now we can't go. She is a CEO administrator. No, no, my CEO we we lecture a CEO to law. I go go zangu pala because konde be mbambil. Because the question is, kisa sami pin de mbamban zogwenzan. Because as the SRC um seven zwe to work for them, Mr. Kulmel student, it's coming in a problem. It's coming in a solution. So we are forced, therefore, to organize a, 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 a pastor to come and pray for him. The only people we know who Ababa Ngawazu Sansa Numfundi said was a Kenya SEO. Okay, so I went to them, said, Guys, let us learn some Numfundis. Because Sifungutulu Muntule is Okulegel. So there were three guys there, Aslanganisa, Numfundi Sangang Mushalom Fundis Utuban. Wafiga Numfundis Hamba Nabanya Bafundis Ababin. So it was three of them, and then two guys from the SEO, and then it was us. In fact, it was seven of us, Sangena A. E. Romin. So they started praying for this guy. So these demons started manifesting. Akuluma, Etretnishumbulala, Ekwekamesho, Doing all these crazy things, to me, seeing that happening, young and Zangabon would in a different world than the real world. Now, in the young and Zanga confirm good Laban to Labago SEO Abafan Nam, in Alice Catamic to a Simbambe. Oh, maybe enjoy it in a macomre to a relaxant. But to me, enjoy Lababo to Baga SO, why Venal Figizalo Etibam Shisa. Then I realized, Uguti, these people, they've got power that we do not have. For us to be able to win those who are not amongst us, other than loving them, is to demonstrate the power of God. We must not be afraid to do that which God has called us to do. If you believe, Uguti, there is nothing that is coincidental. It means, Gwati umaguza bandaba zofunda a medical school. Unkulu unkulu wenza injela. Yoguti fanele gube kona nani gulabu bandu. So that you can show this power. Kuti ina that do not know that you possess this power. Because sina sbona bantu aba porayo, aba in aba out of touch with the reality, aba pilisogo mama mfundi sbe izinga ane. 
angiyeka basalan ngiyabong talugiyek ngiyabong at si sales wagali li point lam bing fisuko sholo kunch siyabong asay lungko lungko luwechisan are you blessed you are in this place can I quickly take three hands but I I think it will be easier if you just come down. If, if you don't mind, or Siham Bisi Mike, can I take three questions or comments? It is interactive, it is a workshop. Nyaz Wuti, they are so eloquent, Nyaz in the understanding, but I think even comments, my questions, number one, can I see the second one? Can I can can I, Amen. Amen. I'm sending Amen. <laughs> I'm sending the mic. I need three. It is a workshop. Come, let's interact. Nyas gonna get banned. Second hand. Number two. Thank you so much. Number three, Ukona. Kuleli side. Yes, Mike. Ginombole. Giveling. Giveling. Kombe. Ayang boning a sand. Amenima. I'll I'll take two. Nyazuko bani follow up ngala. There's a third one. Thank you. God bless you. Ngala ning tatela in that order. Um, Sanman and Mazalane, come and get us. Um, Ikamalami, Mbuyelwa, Magamaisela, Nyam Tanza Chesung, and Chitia Myonge. Um, I am <laughs> really not good with words. Um, I will try though. <laughs> um, I recently, um, Nkuliswe Nyelvangel. My mom is a pastor, if I may say. So being a pastor's kid, it's kind of, oh yeah, you go to church because that's the family thing, that's the family tradition. But recently, I've started discovering Christ on my own. And it's a matter of I'm discovering him in a different way um, starting, I'm not crying, I'm nervous. <laughs> um, so, in a sense of, yes, I believe in God, yes, I believe in Christ, and yes, I have been a child of God, but now it's amplified in a way that and mind you, I have a circle of people and the person that I was, I'm evolving into a different person. So my question is, I love my circle. Uh, I wouldn't be here without my circle, but how do I then adapt? Or how do I help them adapt to the person that I am evolving to in Christ? <laughs> um, just to say, very similar story, exactly identical, but my question is not on that. My question is on e -o 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 evangelism because i know Uguti, as christians we have the great commission Uguti, you have to show christ to everyone but also i believe Uguti, it's it's okay maybe it's a wrong belief but i believe Uguti, evangelism is for abandabatil because my personality type doesn't really allow me to go around <laughs> you know <laughs> Telling people to Jesus loves them, 
but in a way i just i try to show them but i don't know if that's if that's the right way to keep going or if i should come out of my shell and do what the bible tells me to do and Mina, my question is I I was delivered last year from um they they wanted me to to get initiated in Twase. And my question is how do I walk in in, in, in deliverance? Because Guhamba Kambe the, the voices they they come back yeah, well, especially if he's following around someone who has the same spirits yeah, well, and then the voices they 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 come back threatening to 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 kill me I'm, I'm 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 running away from myself and i know that this isn't me this isn't who i want to be but they say i'm running away from what I was born to to do or what I was born to be. So now my question is how how can I keep the, the presence of God around me? How do I how do I <laughs> how do I stay in the presence of the Holy Spirit? Because when he is there, when I, I feel like I am in fellowship, no more the the voices they are silenced, I I, I I I become at, at at peace, but now when I feel like they then they come back. So my question is, how do I keep the presence of God, and how can I continue walking in in deliverance? Um, right, um, I'm going to start with the last one. It's the easy word for me. Right, um, is, is, is he, um, in, in, in Matthew 28, um, verse 18 and 19, um, it, uh, it says, Go ye therefore to the whole world. I'm just paraphrasing. Make disciples and baptize him and all that. So I, I, I believe that in between making disciples and baptism, there is a process. And that process of discipleship, it's all about um, filling the jar with a new wine. So, so, so what that means is there's a pastor who gives this analogy um, using water um, and, and a glass. He says, you see, when you get saved, there is a glass that was full of something filthy. When you receive the word, the glass gets emptied. So the discipleship process in between salvation and baptism is where we fill this glass with something else, which is based on the word of God. So if there is no discipleship, which is all about filling this glass with the relevant message, this glass will remain empty. And when it remains empty, that's when these forces can come and haunt you. The scripture says, um, if, if, if demons are cast out from you, they don't go far. They hang around. Why? Waiting to see if this glass is going to be filled or not. If this glass does not get filled, the Bible says they go and invite cousins and everyone else who is stronger than them. them. Seven more that are stronger than them and they come and they fill this. Now when they fill this, imagine if it was um, sand initially. Now it becomes cement. Why? Because these ones are stronger than, and it becomes difficult to drive these ones out because we did not fill these with anything else. So what it means is if you get saved, you need to intentionally uh, uh, um, seek discipleship so that you can be filled with the relevant message. So when the spirits come, they can get access to you. Wow. Okay. Uh, amen. Amen. <laughs> Lombozo or tea, a Cassette mean in nature. I am correct. I am no man's or two. Oh, so Bolomundo Muena. Go Mundum Tanda, Jesu, a Utando Lock and a loser on a paratigimi. 
kodwa eh ngiba nenkinga uma sekuthiwa ngiphume ngimanje ngicela abantu eh ngiyahluleka eh ngifuna indlela yokuphendula ngiyathanda ukuphendula ngama examples eh in my other life i do a uh, multiple streams of income uh, the kind of marketing is basic so it's a network marketing so go network marketing <coughs> we normally call presentations where we would uh, share the business opportunities with people and so forth uh, but there's something i've learned there ukuthi kuna bantu who grow their businesses but they can't do presentations then ngasinge ba curious ubuze ukuthi laba bantu nina niba uwina kanjani ngoba thina we have to prepare presentation go to present but you've got so big teams but mengibuka ama team abo abantu abafana nabo abantu abasabayo kumaphamu kwabantu so labantu laba uma bebona lo ofana nabo esakusita bayibona i practical land uma bebona ushande mile lapha eqepheza omunye uyashatha down athi ay yena impela ngiyithandela lento kodwa izongihlulake lento enziwa yilo ngi i business ngiyalithanda but ukukhuluma kanje ngeze ngikwazi I have learned ukuthi uNkulunkulu usibizile sonke singafani ngoba nabantu asibizele kubona abafani Omunye wathi you must preach and preach with words if you have to Meaning the preaching iyenzeka ungakakhuluma nani ukukhuluma You can preach to someone and when the person ungakakhuluma nokukhuluma there's a friend of mine Oktua Untobego Mkile is from Eastern Cape when we were doing a course mechanical engineering we did mechanical engineering so into eyangenza ngamthuza ngamthanda as my friend it's because why pass ngangithanda ukuhlala eduze kwakhe ngifuna ukufunda mo but into eyangwina kakhulu ngo Christ kuye ukuthi ngangithi mengidakiwe bemtshele ukuthi urumza wakho udakiwe lapha yolele emgwaqeni ahambe yongilandela engaphuzu tshwala not even once had he ever opened the bible for me but i saw christ in him and fro- from him i learned ukuthi ukukholwa kahle hle kuyini now to answer you mhlaphu umuthi ubungakezwa live your life for christ you will win souls hey ngoba umfundisi omncane bakushiyana umbuzo onzima eh hallelujah hey bozola ne ekho niye ndikhona ikhona nje ikhona 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 le ekhona manje every day nje mina zoku MSCF kunje Wow. Ingakho ntingo mlilo kamoya oyinxele kule ndawo. But um to answer your question I think it's a really relevant question because kwai nami I'm a PK and mina kange yeso into ni Monday to Monday nge force. Ngang faster nge force. Khona lawo baba wayibuya khona nje yeso into ni ethi namhlanje yakhe khona umuntu odlayo. Ngiyawubona uphaya la. Ngiyawubona. Namhlanje yakhe khona umuntu odlayo siya fast. I'm like eight, nine years old. It's mina ngingena up me. No, no, my me and my house will serve the Lord. Mina ngias pele le serving le ngingena up me ngoba ngilambil. But it was being introduced to ama traditions, ama practices. Ngangwa zu menu kufecha ukseva no kora no kube ngego kufesa onde ngisi ngango se. My brother, how are you? I'm blessed and highly favored. How are you? I'm also blessed and highly favored. Lapu ya kwa. But ukbamba ismilo. Nokubamba le act ne pretense iyona into yadala ukuthi when i was 16 17 ngaye ku youth camp 
ngasindiswa ngambona for myself uJesu and then one of the things i realized in my own journey with Jesus Christ ukuthi yena he takes you through a process of development and sometimes kule ya development uba isolated now the isolation yankulunkulu is not so that when uyaphume ebantwini but he's separating you from a specific mindset you can be amongst your friends ube kule yo group ungafithini because it's not calling you to fit in he's calling you to transform now into ezodala ukuthi ubone i progress or the productivity of transformer kwakho ukuthi do you need to stay with these people or not is that are they accepting to the new you or are they not if they are not accepting to the new you then unkulunkulu nexebo lokuthi ungabi sa fellowship nabo kakhulu usuyiwe kwenye direction and the faithfulness of god i've seen in my own life he's able to take away these friends kanti usekuletha kwenye group yabantu abaya lawo yakhona because sometimes sikhalela le group esiyikhethe thina kanti ayikhethiwe uNkulunkulu because when the bible says that light cannot fellowship with darkness it's not only speaking about a believer and unbeliever sometimes the both of us can be christians but i christianity yakho in a darkness and it's defiled but then i christianity yami iya kukhanya kwaNkulunkulu it's pure it, it's facing jesus christ himself so when you are not equally yoked with abantu hamba nabo god sometimes will force them out of your life sometimes uyabona manje ku group yakho sengixabana more than normal unga understand ukuthi kunzekalani mhlambe ususindisiwe une boyfriend naye yasindiswa ona wabili ngene vele ku MCF nisindisiwe but ansabona ngesho ngese lodwa manje khona into engase understand sihlezi ngicabana nje manje ngivu wekuseni ethi good morning low din ukuthi uthe good morning wangayifaka ehathi low sometimes god uses conflict to speak to you to teach you ukuthi akusahambi akusanjiwa ngalendlela le but the one thing that you need to do even usiswam okhala ngokuthi i personality yakhe ayihambisani nale great commission you need to surrender your will sometimes even your personality to that because now i'm an introvert by nature umungasuye kumama ongizalayo ngikwazi ukuthula from monday to sunday ngikhuluma namuntu ngihlala eromini ngiyibhalele uzongibona nje ngibhala kangako facebook ngoba that's just me I, i'm in my head a lot but when i surrendered my personality to christ i understood the good great commission is beyond being an introvert you know being a disciple is beyond being an extrovert it's beyond ukuthi when i was loud when i was silent it's about you submitting even sometimes into uncomfortable ngayo to emission ya moyo ingcwele through you so now is so if you are feeling ukuthi le group okuyona awufuna ukuhlukana nayo maybe this is god's way of testing how submissive you are to his will because in this journey there are going to be times where your heart breaks and i say this ngivala ngale story ngisindiswa mina khona usesenga ngimthanda ay no one much no there was back there da tingadlula lapho khona usesenga ngimthanda a tingadlula lapho uyadlula vele kyadlulwa kyadlulwa nje la kyadlulwa namanje hlambe khona lawo ne heartbreak ucanga ukuthi how am i to live without him uzodlu uzobona the same way was like before uzodlula namanje i understand men zilo no different bonke but different age khofana nomunye ngiyazi uthi inhlizi imhlungu kodwa kuzodlula but then she was not saved and then i was saved and then unkulunkulu what you know you haven't surrendered all ngathi mina kanjani what simele umshiye lo ngathi mina hew tied up satan fire spirits of separation out kanti unkulunkulu oyothestayo ukuthi inhlizo yami sengiyinikile yini kuyena because njengoba etha ngiseparate nayo akabukeli ukuthi manje kuyathandwana ku right because i think a year later when ngiphinde ngimbona bese thwesile seyisangoma so now how was i going to be a young pastor dating kuthokoza gogo siyenza kanjani lento ukuthi khona okhonza phezulu khona okhonza abaphansi how how do we communicate how do we commune so allow god to take you through the process cause you know faithful and he's been in places you haven't been to before which is your future ngiyabona
Um, yeah, so be before, before Uma, just to add on to, to what Umenzi was saying, um, it's very important Oguti, when you encounter Christ, your circle knows. Because the minute you start pushing away from them, it will seem like as if you think you're better than them. And you do not want to send, send the wrong message. They should know, Oguti, the reason why I'm doing this is because of one, two, three. If they want to follow you in the one, two, three that you're doing, they will follow you. If they don't want to follow you, you'll see if you do it, if the separation is done well, later on in life they'll come back to you because they'll realize oh, this person was not neglecting us because we're less than they are, but they were doing this because of a conviction that they have. Ladies and gentlemen, allow me to honor God through these servants. Yes. Mlambe Chepesen give umele ngoba bengi umundo kale is kati. It's just before nine o'clock. Because of the nature you go to some students, nati si funu kwenye is kati. Ngia kela spinde slenzo usugu of a similar engagement. Angazi no magu kwenye mechwene nbantabam. Ngia temba ni fundile kakulo. Leadership Yala, the executive for allowing us this opportunity. Thank you for inviting us. Gibonge Kakuli in the win, and but a lingo last minute. But Unkulunkulun Seben Sile Kakulu, thank you for honoring this invitation for your graces. Let's honor God. <laughs> Gisana lum shabele lent is when yam besent elum mamma, umbata, and kubela wana besesale seva langum kulego. Because this is an opportunity for us to really recommit and position ourselves. Eating to there is a race that I must run, there a victory. To be one gives me power every hour to do. There is a race, there is a race, there are my strong, there are feet to be one.
Kila nkulu nkulu wa chonta mbama Ukulu mega ashe moya wa kiniso Ukulu mega ashe moya ngwele Sia konga nkulu nkulu wa etu Eka meni liga Jesu Christu wa se nazareta Moya ngwele si bongi mfundiso Osfundi se ngazo na mshanje Nkulu nkulu wa chonu ngleyo Kusuga enge luga zini yako Uya enge winsako Nkulu nkulu wa chonu ngleyo Sia bonga moyo ngwele Ugutinke lo fundi senga yo na mshanja Aifani nezi nyi nchela Ngoba izi laka chwaelegi Ukulu magwako akchwaelegi Baba weto ngwele Epsugu Sia tanda za ngulu ngulu wetu Sitimbela Asimbona ngu ngulu ngulu fana nawe Sitimbela Asimbona ngu ngulu ngulu nshe ngawe Eka meni liga Jesu Christu Wase Nazareta Baba wetu ngwele Sesi ya puma ngulu ngulu wetu Sie ingini zetu mnini manda onke Engati moyo ngwele lezi mfundiso Nezi lako unga shale inti zon zetu Eka meni liga Jesu Christu Christu, who has sent us a letter, my God, my Father, Nkulu Nkulu Wetongwele, Utomu Yemaya Kuluma, Watas Hambe Baze Babone, Sihambi Sogwako, Eka Meni, Liga Jesu Christu, who has sent us a letter, Nkulu Nkulu Wetongwele, Siafumu Utimas Puma Glenda, Nkulu Nkulu Wetongwele, Siopili Zilako, Siafumu Utimas Puma Glenda, Sion shuma ya nizi lako Ngengambo eso ipila Empagatini ngengambo Eso ipila Emarasi Ngengambo eso ipila Eikone na siguzo Ngengambo eso ipila Empagatini na siguyo Eka meni liga jesu Wase na zareta Baba siya tandaza Eka meni liga jesu Kristu Wase na zareta Atu mshabele li Ngali londa Izwi lako Enki zweni yami Kulu kulu wachongwele Goba singe nje luto Ngaleli izwi Singe pumelele Kapande wezwi Singe ngobe luto Kapande wezwi Izwi lako ni ispani We thank you Jesus Singe zibongo Singe zutu molonke Nengazi mulo yonki nge yako Na manda nukosi nukakabuli bonke Ibanda liga krestu Niti amen teachings are, are, are solid and are strong and it is my prayer um, can attest before I the service I was so scared when he overwhelmed because Beng beng guys, we should go and I remember man beka even if you are good, beng was set with us about two lama workshop. So now ma me me encourage you to me let's see beng here. I'm thinking we should shooting and pelang me let's see. Siabonga basala nengala u. 
I no ma i worship team tella i si pe i worship i i ngo ma i praise and then si tella ama contributions bazar tella ni ke le kamen ni konsi. Amen. Father, we thank you so much for such a wonderful gift that you have given to us. We give because we have seen you giving unto us. We pray, Heavenly Father, therefore, in the mighty name of Jesus Christ, for all those who have given in the name of Jesus Christ, that you continue to bless them, O Father, and na la pavata teko na ngulungulu andise in the name of Jesus Christ for your for this organization to continue to function. We thank you, Father, in Jesus' name, Amen. Heavenly Father, oh, because I'm saying Krumanan, Ninjan, I'm starting to Kruman, Uncle Uncle, Captain Krumanan. Eh, I would like to greet you, Bazalane. Thank you so much for coming and in saying Bona Ava Abantu who are blessing us, Seva Hambile. So I'll be giving you the announcements, but Gizwil, Umoya Ngwele Namwang Ambule, Lugutin Ben Krumango, Christ Love. It's such a wonderful thing, Bazalwane. Sometimes you don't always have to speak, you just have to live and be like Christ. Amen. So, my name is Mraudzimaimo Prudence. For those who do not know me, um, I come all the way from Limpompo and then I travel close to 14 hours to be here. 
and it's such an honor to be here and to fellowship with you guys so the announcements that i have the first one uh we're gonna be having our normal service or our service the next coming friday and oh i thought yeah, so sorry. <laughs> okay so we're gonna be having um our friday service next week and at the same time and the same place and we also going to be having the women of virtue service on wednesday half past five please do join join in ladies and men of impact we also gonna be having it this coming tuesday half past five as well please do join in bazalwane and then we're gonna be having the rest fellowships if you noticed uh the first year's rest fellowships being echo this week but the next week it's gonna be there monday kongela and kailisha please do join in vazalwane and it's just the usual thursday tafta and then sunday bethel as well as lb so uh those are the only announcements that we have thank you so much vazalwane for coming and for blessing us i hope i'm not leaving anything behind Sibonge, all of us, can we just pray and thank the Lord for this wonderful time. Heavenly Father, it's not because of our own intelligence. We do not take credit of any of this, O oh God. But you continue to teach us so beautifully, O oh Father. And you continue to guide us, O oh God. But Heavenly Father, we thank you that you consider us yours and you love us, O oh Father. And because you see that we are enthusiastic, O oh God, you want us, Heavenly Father, to be the, the to be the children who are like Christ in Jesus' name and resemble your nature, O oh Father, to the people of the world, that they may see And we pray, Heavenly Father, as we submit ourselves to you, O oh God, not our own ways, but we pray that your ways to prevail in our lives, O oh God. Not our own wills, O oh God, but we surrender our desires to you. And it's your guidance, O oh God, and your correction that you may continue to rebuke us. Right? But we pray, Heavenly Father, that may we always inquire from you, O oh God. But in everything, may we submit, O oh God, our mind. May we submit our bodies as well, because this is the temple of the Holy Spirit. So we cannot be contaminating our bodies, O oh Father, with the things of the world. But may we keep ourselves holy and remember that, O oh God, you are holy and you instruct us to be holy in the name of Jesus Christ. May we continue, O oh Father to be holy even in our minds to be holy even in our dreams to be holy in our walk before you O oh god and to be holy with what we speak in the name of jesus christ O oh father and i pray upon this people O oh father upon ourselves in the name of jesus christ that there is nothing that the devil can pose before us O oh god that will take us away from you O oh god in Bella, we believe that when paul says nothing can ever separate us from your love it's it's indeed exactly that, O oh Father. And we trust you in everything. And this journey, O oh God, we do not want to walk it alone, but we give everything to you that you may continue to guide us, O oh Father. May our lives, O oh Father, continue to be the sweet fragrance of, pro of praise and worship before you, O oh Lord. In Jesus' name, Father, we pray. Amen. Um, KL, you're still using Tafta Bus. I'm not sure if Likon in Bus Lekon Likon, intake. Likon. Okay, so KL people, I will people, you can use the Tafta Bus and Kongela, it's the requesting, it's, it's requesting as well. Ne? Okay, so see you on the bus.